we're both very strong-headed people. And neither one of us liked being told what to do. (laughs) And it wasn't until we came to the understanding of a lot of biblical teaching and and what God's will is for our life and a relationship and for our marriage, how we truly realized how we should treat each other. You know, as far as honoring and working harder and... And respecting each other. We dated for a few years before marriage. Five. Five years (laughs) before marriage. And it wasn't as fun as we thought it was going to be, especially the living in sin part, because we always felt like maybe we should probably be married. Even though we were happy together, there was always something missing. We kind of prayed every now and then. We both believed in God. We didn't go to church. We thought we could be God people without having to go to church. It wasn't something that was essential for our life. And I decided to go to Bible study, and I went, and I loved it. And I would come home at night and tell them how awesome it was and how fun the people were. She'd start telling me about it, and then for a while, she wouldn't tell me, she'd just go. And that's when I kind of was like, okay, what's going on over here? I gotta check it out. Ever since then, we've been going to Bible study, and eventually, a year or two after that, we started going to church. Through the years, it seems that God and Jesus have been put on the back burner. And it's sad, because I noticed the change in our lives when we're more involved, and when we let God lead us, than when we don't. When we don't, it seems like we're falling apart. Chaotic. It's very chaotic. Things still happen, good and bad, when you're saved and when you're prayerful and you're in the spirit, but the peace that you have to endure the storm, to get through it, is amazing. It's like none other. How do you forgive? I think forgiveness is something I still struggle with, but I'm working on it. I've made a lot of mistakes. And God forgives me every time, always and forever. Finding God is something that's helped me come to peace and be able to be happy. Be happy in my life with my family and lay down that burden of sorrow and depression and hurt. It wasn't until we actually accepted God into our heart and felt the Holy Spirit that things started to change. And I know we wouldn't be married today. We wouldn't have made it without God. He's our foundation. I just encourage anybody that doesn't know God, find Him.